Hey everybody, Pretty Clever 18 here today with a tour of my Lego shelf that is in my Lego room full of some mocks, my favorite sets, my favorite minifigures, and more. So, we'll just get right into it. Starting off at the very top shelf here, I have some bigger sets on display, lots of Lego space and Lego movie. Starting with the biggest set, and that is Benny's Spaceship, Spaceship, Spaceship. I also have that box on display. I have the Research Institute set, the Exosuit set. I have the uh, Super Secret Police Dropship. I have the Research Institute box behind here. I have the Exosuit box here. I have the Lego Movie Double Decker Couch set. On top of the Benny Spaceship box, I have this exclusive Bricktober uh, Toys R Us movie theater, as well as these this 2014 classic spaceman set the white I also have this rare Lego sprue a golden Lego sprue as well as a bunch of 2x4 minifigures in a different color we'll just do a quick overview of the shelf again just that's the top shelf and it's full of my favorite sets coming down to the first cubby this is actually what I consider all my, my minifigure cubby it is full of a bunch of exclusive minifigures custom minifigures and more the one minifigure here is the Western Emmett. Another is this Chase McCain minifigure. It is not open yet, but I'm going to open it and then put the poly bake up like the others. And then I have the Pajama Emmett. Here at the back, we have this sort of custom case. It's kind of hard to see with the light on my camera, but I'll back up a little. And it is my custom Benny, my custom Nicki Minaj, my custom uh, reindeer suit girl my custom Scooby-Doo and then on the bottom here we just have some other minifigures such as the Team Mutant Ninja Turtles whatever that's called this old minifigure and then the director's minifigure with a custom clapper board I made those are just I'm gonna reorganize this shelf eventually but this is what I have it now we have the Lego minifigure collector kit from Toys R Us in 2010 maybe I can't remember the exact date when you spent $75 in October, you got this minifigure kit. It came with five minifigures, and they're all a little older. Coming down here are some of the exclusive minifigures, or rare minifigures, or hard-to-find minifigures, or my favorite minifigures. We have this Pajama Emmett, this Brick Loot minifigure, Western Emmett. We have a bunch of Brick Fett minifigures. That is the Canadian Leaf, the Brick Fett itself, Kevin Hinkle this brick fat QR code one and then just this brick fat regular one the toy soldier the birthday minifigure and this uh, Explorer minifigure kit from Brick Fair Virginia 2013 from the Slay Charity Foundation when you donated you got the set we have some minifigures that I submitted for a contest at Brick Fett Ottawa this sleeping bunny which is a custom bunny that I actually made represented you know, on a like a little stuffed animal that I had when I was a little. Even though I was the only person who entered, I still won. <laughs> we have this custom uni kitty here. I also won a contest with it, even though I was the only one. And then my latest custom, this SWAT team minifigure. I have not, at the time of filming, I have not done a video on that, but that will change. We have this other exclusive Lego Land brick. Some Lego train cars. The uh, 2004 13 Brick Fair, Virginia set. Bunch of business cards, a business brick, this Target, Target exclusive, this gumball machine, and the White House Dale minifigure. I also entered it, but I did not win. I, that one I won on this one instead. And then we just have some other packaging back there. Moving on over to this set is this, this house, which I just really like. And then this, uh, uh, police transport I just put it there I had nowhere else to put it but I like the house that's one of my favorite creator houses that I still have built moving down to this uh, uh, shelf here there's not really much there just a bunch of mix mixels and some animals I have not done really anything with them I'm like I just kind of have them there I don't know where I'm gonna do with them we actually have a closed shelf which I open it up and it's actually my studio part where I film some videos you, you maybe see them when they're minifigures you know kind of up, really up close talking that is this it's just a set with a bunch of you know like minifigures with cameras and stuff like that just kind of cool shut that up here 
down below, I consider I used to consider this to be my Lego movie shelf, but now I actually have a lot of Lego movie sets elsewhere. Just a bunch of cool things that I have for the Lego movie, you know, the glider, a couple of LED lights, the Benny Pen, Cloud Sukulu Palace, my own double decker couch, lots all the CMF minifigures that I had, the melting room. Just a lot of things for the Lego movie that I have collected. Over here is another closed shelf, and basically what I have in there is used parts for my whoops, used parts for my Brickling store. Not very exciting. Here on the very bottom shelf we have my Lego books. So I actually have a lot of books starting from, I have them organized from small to large. And I think they're pretty cool. They vary from the Bible to mini, everything about minifigures, all about Lego, all about Harry Potter, like they just vary. And finally my last shelf is another unorganized shelf just full of sets that I like but don't really have anything to do with or have to put somewhere. They're just really cool. There's also some mocks here, you know, like the old monorail. I have this McDonald's set from a Happy Meal, Minecraft, the Apple Tree House. Just some cool things. Thank you so much for watching this tour of my Lego shelf. I really hope you enjoy. I'm always changing this shelf up, so it's not going to be the same for very long. Who knows, it could even be changed all around by the time I upload this video. Probably not, but I really like it, and someday I actually hope to get set shelves in my Lego room built right into the wall. And when, if that ever happens, I'll do a video on those shelves. Thanks a lot for watching this Lego shelf tour. I hope you had a great day. Let me know what you thought of this video. Don't forget to like this video, share this video with your friends, comment on this video, and of course, subscribe. Thanks a lot for watching, everybody.